What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about Saika Ika. I think that's how you pronounce it. Defensive lineman from Baylor. He's 6'4 and 358 pounds. He is a big-ass dude. And he's a nose tackle. That's that's what he is. Uh, one tech, zero, depending on your scheme. If you're a 3'4, he'll be a zero. If you're a 4'3, line him up at one tech and let him you know, run-stop people. Probably take him off the field on you know passing downs. Um... Could probably drop a few pounds, even as a big-ass nose tackle, 358 pounds is, is, is kind of heavy. So I imagine he'll probably bring that down once he gets to the league. Like even Vita Vea had to lose a little bit of weight when he got into the league. Um, he's not going to give you very much in the way of pass rush. He does give you some. Like He does have good effort in that regard. It's just not his game. Um, but he does have a pretty decent swim move that he can use, which is what gives him a little bit of upsize as a, upside as a one-tech. Um, but he is very good about eating up double teams. Um, people don't move him. I've seen, you know, offensive lines try to put two people on him, three people on him and try to move him. He just doesn't fucking move. He's strong as shit. Um, and he will also jump up and get his hands up to try to bat balls down, which is great. Strong as hell. Has some real anger to him, uh, and tenacity. And despite him being big as hell, he will run to the ball, which is awesome. Um... I think he's a fun one tech that can play zero for you. I, I like him better as a one um, in a four three type of scheme. But if you are a three four, don't hesitate to draft him. I think you can plug this guy in, this guy in it as zero and be absolutely fine. And even most three four teams, once you go into your nickel packages, you're going to be running more of a four three anyway. Um, even if your defense, even if your edge rushers are standing up and they're and not with their hands in the dirt, it from a blocking standpoint, it's still a four three. Um, it, it is what it is. Um, you got, you know, two edge rushers on either side. You've got basically a three tech <laughs> lining up over the guard, and then you've got a uh, basically a one tech in in the gap. So it it all ends up being kind of a four three once you go into the nickel packages, which is the bulk of what the league is now. Teams are very rarely in their quote unquote base packages. Nickel packages are basically base packages now. Um, but I do like him a lot. He's not a super great athlete. Probably going to be like a third or fourth round guy. He is, he is a pretty good nose tackle. But nose tackles tend to not go super high unless you are like a Jordan Davis type of guy. And this, that's not what he is. He's, he's a really solid ass player. And he, he also has shown the ability to pull cloth, which is nice. So he can shed people off of him when he wants to. But for the most part, he's just going to eat up blocks. Um, and just be a dope-ass nose tackle and free up other people. That's mostly going to be his role for you. Um, but he does have a little bit of upside, like I said, with that swim move and that cloth pull. If people are going to put themselves out of position and lean forward or anything like that, he's very good at you know uh, taking advantage of those situations. So, yeah. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. If you liked it, I appreciate hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments in the comments down below, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.